the Netherlands. A small but beautiful country where everything is taken care of very well. However, many people don't know about the horrible dark side that our country is dealing with. Human trafficking and forced prostitution. Unfortunately, this happens to many young innocent girls, mostly in their puberty, so that they can be manipulated easily. Age starting as young as 9 years old. What happens to these girls breaks my heart. This is why I work together with Free A Girl. Free A Girl fights against human trafficking and forced prostitution of young girls and makes sure that they get the right treatment to recover. I am Tatiana Mal, Miss World Netherlands, and I am a representative for Free A Girl. This year I've been working hard to raise as much money for Free A Girl as possible by taking part in many different fundraising events. I have been collecting donations I locked myself up in a cage for over 12 hours to create awareness and I visited several projects of Free A Girl to work with their victims. One of these projects involves victims of so-called lover boys. Lover boys are pimps, human traffickers who do the most horrible things. Lover boys are men who pretend to love a girl. Once the girl falls for him, he will force her into prostitution. She will be abused, beaten and go through hell in a world of sex, drugs and crime. This is modern slavery. The victims of lover boys are helped at an organization called FEAR, a place where they get intense therapy to recover. Here they get back their confidence so that they can eventually return into society again as strong, powerful women. They learn how to say no and to mark their boundaries. Contact with the girls will be remained even after their recovery period is finished. Activities like cooking and sports are part of their therapy. This year I have been visiting the girls regularly to help them with these activities, which makes me feel very connected with them. During the activities they can tell their stories. I see them as young, strong women, as survivors, and I have nothing but the deepest respect for them. I am so thankful that I am able to help them with their recovery by doing something I love as well. This way I can share my passion and make others happy. To see them smile is amazing and it motivates me to help them even more. It's very important that these girls have someone to talk to after they're saved and won't be judged. I've had many conversations with several victims of Loverboys. Amy is one of them. She was forced into prostitution, was abused, beaten daily, forced to take drugs, and so on. This went on for years. I just closed my eyes. I think that I always closed my eyes when I closed my eyes, then it was as if it was not and as if it was not happening. She wanted to escape. She wanted to be free. Eventually, a doctor sent her to fear. Because of her therapy at fear, she is recovering well and doing a little bit better every day, just like many other girls. At FEAR, there's a chat program financed by Free A Girl, where victims like Amy can contact a social worker who can give them support, tips and advice. This way, they can be saved from where they are being held and exploited. Girls are beautiful, and they all deserve the right to be in control of their own body and future. Together with Free A Girl, I won't stop fighting against these horrible lover boys. I will not stop until every girl is free and until every girl is able to live the life she truly dreams of.